All right, we got a board and we are in the fourth position. What is going on? Oh my God. Five, 10, nine looks pretty good just on the basis of the wheat situation here. I think I would really like something like the eight, four, 10, six, 11, five. That'd be kind of nice. So yeah, I think a lot of players would gravitate towards the five, nine, 10, right? Just saying, hey, I'm going to get the best wood, the best ore, and the best wheat. It's a pretty good option. Boom, okay. You also have the wood port too. Uh, you're probably not going to beat the guy who has the brick here. I like the 1083, makes sense. You get the brick and you get the wheat. Now the issue here, we might have to play wheatless, but if they take something like 6511 saying, hey, I'm going to get cute, we are going to rip absolutely instantaneously. I'll just, I'll, I'll get ready to pre-move it. Pretty much the 5910, point right, 1084, point left. Go to the ore port, 31, take road. That's this setting, this setup right here, 1048, 5910 is winning, just straight up. So, oh, what is that? What is that? So what do we want to do here? There's a few things. I think we're definitely taking the 6511, and I think we could go like some like 6511 up. Then we can also do the 9512 point right, and I still think the ore port's a pretty good play. Pretty happy with that. I'm also seeing someone's going to go like 6411 point right. The issue is we might lose the sheep port there. And then we're really just 411 and ore port. Uh, this feels really greedy by black, I'm not gonna lie. I think we take the 5912 as our second set. What do you think? We've got some time here, we don't have to rush this. Actually, you know what too, I really like this 348 left if you got something like 63. But we can play like a fun little game here. I think what we need to do is We'll, we'll take the 11 and the 12, that'll be our wheat. I think we're just gonna have to try to city as much as we can, as fast as we humanly can here. I can also see, you know, this is the issue with black. You've got to think about, this is a very risky move because I can see a, I can see a case that green tish takes 810, straight up, just eight, 810 down. You get all five resources, you get the 910 expansion, best wood, second best brick, and then, mm, I don't know, this is too weak for me. Or he takes that, <laughs> and then he'll take the 810. Come on, come on 810. Like what else could he do? I guess he could do something like take the sheep pile, but something tells me he's gonna really value the brick here. You can even go eight, 10 left. And I think there's a shot that you get the three, four, eight here. All right, guys, this is a wacky setup. You can see a world where it takes six, four, 11. Yeah, point right, it's pretty good. I just need two subtle spots. I need the four, 11 and I need the ore port and I'm done, we're good. That's true as well. Yeah, you can do eight, four up. And I think there's a case that you end up winning that race. This is a wax setup. So absolute must here guys is the city we need a city the question is where do we city hopefully it's he puts it on the 10 here i feel like we're gonna get hit though we can't lose the wheat we can't lose the wheat okay good 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 <clears throat> i'm okay with this it doesn't really hurt us too much oh yes yes oh baby all right where do you guys want us to city i think we got a city i mean the pop when you get a city in this position you take it i think we got to get the wheat up and running guys don't you think yeah yeah, we've already got a ton of ore, but we've got to make this 11 a little bit more meaningful. Sure, we're going to get targeted like a monster, but it is what it is. And now our main goal is to get to the ore port, because then we can substitute that extra ore for the wheat. Oh, that hurts. So who's the... Oh, that hurts. <laughs> who's enemy number one here? Also, I'm, I'm willing to start to get some of these other resources. Yeah, it's a brutal block. It is a brutal block. I don't have wood there, buddy. Also, I'd, I never think we would get anything. I guess I'll take anything for the shape here. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Ugh, what a brutal block. Yeah, we don't really have too many good numbers. Oh my goodness. There we go. So we got a development card. I'm pretty happy about that. Holy sheep. So let's pop here. What do you think it's gonna be? I think it's gonna be a VP. Oh, nice. That's huge, guys. That is huge. All right, pretty good start, not gonna lie. Man, maybe I should go sheep port. No, nah, I think it's just 411 in the ore port, to be honest with you. Yeah, it's a huge... Oh my god, that's 9 ore this guy's blocked. That sucks. Now that's unlucky. Is there anywhere else we can go? Like, I feel like grabbing all the sheep, like, this 3 hex spots are huge. But without the port, we can't do much with it. My god, that's 12 ore. That's so brutal, man. Yes, yeah, yeah, we'll take this. It's probably really good for him. But I think anytime we can get one for one with our sheep, he's not going to give it to us. Once more, hey, Mr. Danny Drew, I heard you are a vicious plower who doesn't care about your opponent's revenge blocking. I can't wait to see this high confrontational gameplay. 
We'll see about that. Yeah. I'd have to say green's doing very well here. That's perfect. Hopefully they recognize my inflexibility. I also think black's probably pissed. Yeah, black has to be absolutely pissed here. Finally. All right. <laughs> um, can we start to get some other resources? Ideally, if we can get things like this, you know, maybe next turn. I'm also willing, willing to hold here. Frankly, I think Black's just pissed that he lost all that ore, and I understand, sir. Let's go! Nice 11. All right, we might be able to trade some of this wheat for... Holy smokes. All right. I think we can actually get some good deals with this wheat here, and I'm willing to do one for one. Otherwise, I think the pop's pretty good. I'll report you for language. <laughs> Come on, guys. Is there any wood out there? I, I might just be smoking. I think two pops are pretty good, right? Yeah, it's a wonderful hand. I mean, if I could use the road builder, I totally would. Um, why don't we do something like this as well? I just want to get the stuff out of my hand. And I think the ore port's just so nasty here. So I'm going to try one more trade, and then otherwise we'll pop twice, which I think is pretty good. Yep, yep, perfect. Yep, perfect. All right, so there's the beginning of army for us. Yeah, we need this ore port so bad. Holy smokes. <laughs> All right, one more 11 for the boys. Oh, he's pissed. He's pissed. Um, let's think this gets us close. Any ore roll gives us probably going on the eight here. That's fine. So for us, we're always going to be blocking the 10 here. The 10 is definitely one of the key rolls. Otherwise, also, I think the eight has some venom. Also, we got to be careful. Black is buying devs here. Yeah, so let's pop one more time. Oh my god. Oh, what the hell is this, man? <sighs> what the hell is that? Was the reasoning for not going... It's pacing, yeah. Um, and I just think also we need to make sure that we have our hexes open here. That's pretty important. So what has he got? He has a brick. The brick is fantastic for us. That's really good. Now the question is, do we play a development card? Like, do we play the road builder? I'm kind of of the mind of holding here. What I would actually think now, I'm thinking about getting the 634 and then going to sheep port. I'm starting to think that's actually the better play. I don't want to do anything too sudden. Oh my god. 111, we're cooking here. <laughs> oh my god. What? What is this? Um, so I'll take this for a wood. That's pretty good for me. Also, we can pop again. He's also going for the pops. We get a wheat here, don't we? From black. He's also going for horse fun. Is there anywhere I get a sheep here? Is Catan going to be an evergreen game like chess? Maybe. We'll see about that. I think we got to hold these road builders, honestly. I think there's some really strategic plays, like 634 is just really good for us. And frankly, we'll outpace, we'll all outpace everyone here, I think, long term. Dude, this is brutal. This is so brutal. And then a six is, let's do something like this. Actually, I don't think he he doesn't have it, does he? No, he doesn't have wood. Not really tracking, I suppose. No aggressive knight? I don't have to. He's so far behind. He's so far behind. We can do one now, though, because we definitely get the we get the sheep, right? No. Damn it. Yeah, that's fine with me. Yeah, he's not going to be able to catch us long term here, I don't think. Two road builders is whack as hell, though. Well, yeah, 11's doing well. And also, like, I'd be happy even we just get 112. Honestly, probably the ore port's better for us. By the way, I hope everyone's doing amazing. All right, here comes the knight. He's so... There's no way. Doesn't have a knight. Whew. Um, should we try to hit green here? What does he have? Green has everything we need. Let's go be aggressive. He's doing okay, too. That's fine with me. I think one alternative is we can port for the wood. And what, we've got a knight? Let's do that. We're playing very aggressive. There it is. Okay. All right, or port it is, baby. And I think that's also a city in our hand, right? Q7 out. How, don't you dare. <laughs> don't you dare. Okay. So we're going to go here, here. Now, do we actually set up for the sheep port play? Like, does 411 really matter to us at this point? Probably not. 
Now the question is, do we just buy another city? And I think the answer is yes. So what's our hand? We got an extra knight. We got the road builder and the ore port is live as well. I think it's just another city here, guys. This is so brutal. Like, look at this. And then actually we just city, we just city and road, right? With the road builder. It's like really that easy. Yeah, there's just no way. Now the nine's open. Okay, so everything's good here. Nines are great here. So where do I block? What am I scared of? I could stop any roads with the nine. Like, like black's dead. So it's got to... I'm not scared of anybody. Let's hit the 10 here. Nice. Let's hold here. We could also port for a wood. Well, this is close to the win, isn't it? Like we just win next turn. Also, we can port for a wheat, which I think is pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just port for the wheat. I think um, the wheat's always useful here, whether we're getting the settle. Exactly. This is more over than my marriage. It's pretty brutal, right? It is pretty brutal. So I'm just eating a, a cinnamon roll. Are these? Okay, no, no. So we can win this. Just settle road. Easy game. Yeah, I mean, this was also a function of just, it's a great setup. If we get a couple, oh my God. We, you know, we get a couple 11s, which we did. We got very lucky. And also strategically going for the early city, you know, starting with the two ore and the wheat. And then literally just straight up rolling into the city in the first orbit. I, I guess you could say it's lucky, but that was also the game plan from the start. Yeah, we can city road or we can settle road. Doesn't matter. I mean, damn, we might be able to even do both if we get a five. Like, we might be able to do like 11 point play. Ooh. All right, no seven. Yeah, it's over. Oh, you got a mono at this point. So what does he have? He's got two VPs. That sucks. Yeah, two road builders is pretty nuts too. Yep, a little bit too good. I, I don't know if it's well played. I mean, that was just kind of a, uh, we just balled out way too hard there. Close game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know what was going on earlier. They were reporting for language or doing some sort of interesting stuff there. Yeah, I, I mean, trying to minimize the damage. But I mean, just the rolls straight up were nuts. The robs, you know, we got robbed second least. No trades, unfortunately. Also, let's keep in mind, after all that too, that five block decimated. I don't really know. I mean, what do you guys want to say about this game, right? Like, it was just kind of ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. So we'll keep plugging along. I think logically the five, nine, ten's good. Eight, ten, three is good. Makes a lot of sense to me. I think black is where this went off the rails. I expected them to do six, five, eleven, which I think is great. And then, you know, for me, I would get something like the 5, 9, 10, 8, 4, 10, play side by side, run to the ore port. The donkey sends meta. This is a nothing to learn. Go next game. All right. All right. Fine. Fine. <laughs> hey, you know, you got to appreciate those moments.